You can also enable no cooldown. So this is gonna be a lot faster as well if you use that. I just got level 13 and I'm like one minute into this auto farm. Nice. So today I'm gonna be showing you the best and latest and the only working project slayer scripts. With these scripts you can auto farm dungeons, you can auto farm quests, you can auto farm NPCs, you can get god mode, you can unlock game passes and so many more OP features. The only thing you're gonna need is gonna be Zeus. This is the best free keyless Roblox exploit that's working on Windows after the new anti-cheat update. So let's get right into it. Also, somewhere in this video, you're gonna find a Roblox gift card for a thousand Robux. So don't forget to watch the video entirely and also don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos like these. To download Zeus, go to the first link in the description, you'll be going to omgexploits.com and then just scroll down and you'll see right here Zeus, just press on this download button right here. After that, you're gonna see Zeus right here, just scroll down a bit and then you'll see download Zeus right here, just press on that. Then just complete these simple tasks, then just wait a couple of seconds, sometimes it takes like 30 seconds to verify that you actually did it, and then you will be getting Zeus. After you have got Zeus, just open the zip file that you got and put it on top of your desktop. After that, just open Zeus. So then Zeus will be opened, if you can see, if you go to the game tab, you will see all the games right here and they are all working. Now you need to open the Microsoft Store and search for Roblox. Just wait a couple of seconds, press on Roblox, and then just download it, and then press on play. Zeus won't work unless you're on the Microsoft Store version of Roblox. After Roblox is opened from the Microsoft Store, just uh, hit on play on Project Slayers and pop up your Zeus. So after you are inside Project Slayers, just press on this inject button right here, and then just wait a couple of seconds, and then it's gonna say injected right here. After that, if you go to the game tab, just press on Project Slayers right here. After that, this Zeus hub will open. Inside here, you will have some other GUI. The Skewed hub is the best one at the moment. It has the best features and the most OP features as well. And if you open this, the Zeus hub will go away. So now I'm gonna be showing you the Skewed hub since this is the best one at the moment. If you can see, the key is uh, T-Y-A-L-E-X-X. But if the key changes, I will also be changing it inside the Zeus hub. So no worries, the Zeus hub will be closing and then the other one will be opening. Dy Alex and then enter. And then the skewed hub, skewed hub opened. Here you can you you need to do some settings first. I'm not gonna select an NPC because the fastest way to uh, level up is to use the form all NPCs. But first select your form method. I'm gonna do above as always. Then I'm gonna select fast, and then my uh, weapon. I'm just gonna do fist or claws. It doesn't really matter. And then change your distance to like 10 maybe, and then the kill aura delay to two seconds. And then uh, select kill aura OP. And then you can select farm all NPCs and then it's gonna start to auto farm. First it takes a bit but then it's gonna be like really fast. also enable like auto loot and stuff. And it also has a webhook for the auto loot to see uh, whatever you've got in your discord. Look how fast it's going now. If you can see I just uh, leveled up my claws. Oh my god, this guy almost got one tapped. You can also do boss farms. I just selected farm all bosses. So it's gonna go to the closest boss and it's gonna kill him. If you can see, he can't even hit me. And this is a boss, guys. So look how fast he's dying. This is like super OP. Oh my god, I just leveled up and also leveled up my masteries. So the boss farm gets you such a high level. Now I'm fighting uh, Sabito. He can't even hit me. Like, this is like super OP, guys. I just leveled up my masteries again and almost level 9. So it's going like so fast, guys. Ooh, this one is a bigger one. But he still can't hit me. And I'm still killing him like really fast. And I don't even have like any OP weapons or, or something. Just died again. Let me change my stats to 10 because uh, he just hit me and that's uh, not supposed to happen. 
I think uh, when it's at 10, it's uh, is the best While one. While I am out of farming, let me show you the other tabs. So just press on this one uh, on the left top. And then press on teleports. And then you can teleport to trainers, whatever trainer you want to do. And then on the mix tab, there is also going to be auto skill. So I'm just going to do auto use all my abilities. I don't even know if I have abilities. But if you use abilities, it's going even faster. So make sure to enable your abilities. Because look how fast it is. I just got level 13 and I'm like one minute into this auto farm. You can also enable no cooldown. So this is gonna be a lot faster as well if you use that. You can also auto all buff. I'm not sure what it is but it's risky as well. Let me do that real quick. I think it buffs my abilities and stuff. But I'm not no sure. Drown, auto meditate. Uh, activate white screen if you wanna do that. Uh, this will increase your FPS in the game if you wanna tell... I mean... Uh, Auto farm overnight. Now let me show you the infinite stamina, no sun damage. Oh, that guy's uh, infinite bread. Where is the auto pick up flowers? Okay, now it's gonna go and auto farm flowers for me. You can get the progress game pass. So now you can go and you can see your game, your progress. It's just picking up flowers for me. If you can see, it just picked up. I can uh, see it in my inventory. Uh, how do I access my? Oh my god, if you can see, I have 9 flowers already. And also the loot from the demons I have slayed. So this is super open. show you guys. the other hubs real quick. The Valium hub on the section 1 is gonna be auto farm. So uh, choose your method. I'm gonna do above. And then I'm gonna leave it at 8. And then you can just select your, um, your mob. I'm gonna do civilian to start with. But make sure to select kill aura. And then select... Uh, combat or whatever you want to do but make sure to not equip your weapon if you do that uh, you will get kicked i will also enable auto use uh, skills and then you can press on auto farm uh, mob you can also auto eat souls and auto loot chests teleport wherever you want then so uh, visual stuff you can uh, enable esp and stuff and see like flowers if you can see f uh, flowers are right there and stuff there's also gonna be a f uh, flower farm the right farm here. Hub real quick it's gonna open in here then you can uh, select farm flowers and then it will go and it will uh, get the flower for you and then it's gonna go ahead and go to the next flower you can also teleport to stuff you can uh, tel teleport to final uh, selection and then it's gonna go right there it's really fast Then in the Oni hub, this one has some features that the other hubs don't have. If you go to the mist tab, you will see right here some really cool uh, mist move. Rangoku mode for human uh, only. Uh, there is also for human and demon. There is also no sun damage. Here are some farm settings. You can choose your kill aura and stuff. This is the only one that has the war fan skill aura. So you can enable the war fan skill aura. And this is the only hub that has it. So that's pretty cool. And also the add blocking and remove blocking. It will just uh, block the abilities from the mobs that you're gonna Local kill. Player uh, settings such as infinite breeding, infinite stamina. You can also uh, repair weapon. Also some uh, visual stuff such as no fog and uh, no stun as well. You can also lag the server. And there is also gonna be a Mugen train auto farm. 